Hey guys, what's up? Welcome. Today is a total body workout. We're going to be doing a strength move followed by a body weight move. This is going to keep your heart rate up. It is going to feel like a superset today. It is going to be one killer workout. We have 10 blocks of work, two moves, 30 seconds of full out effort with a 10 second transition. It is a repeat. So you're going to turn it up one notch when you come back. Hey, if you're new to this channel, welcome. Do make sure that you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you do not miss any workouts. We have a quick three minute warm up. We're gonna do a moving squat. So we're gonna step out to the right, drop into that squat, in and to the left. So take your time. Now, just a little bit about this workout. When we do 30 seconds, like typically it's like a 40 to 45, I want you to go heavy. So maybe the first time you do it, you're trying to find the weight. And then the second time, maybe you need to go up a little bit heavier. We're gonna lunge back, left leg, reach up arms, and switch. So we do that strength move first, and then we're gonna follow it up with a body weight move. Some of them are gonna feel cardio-ish, but they're also focusing on strength. Really lengthen the arms all the way up. Lateral lunge, and over. You can use the arms, you can do windmill arms, reach out. And you're gonna see a couple sections of burpees today. But remember, there are ways to modify. So let's just do a low impact bur burpee. Hands go down, step back, pause, step forward, rise up, reach. So right now we're just working on the range. So bend those knees, big step back, wide, up. Step right foot forward, hold it, runner's lunge, add a twist, drop the hips, switch that, runner's lunge, open up, both feet come forward, march or jog, get it going, are you guys really feeling up to it today? It's going to be a big workout, oh yeah! Jumping jacks, tap or open close. I'm ready. Whew, it's going to be a good one. You're going to feel your whole entire body work today. Little run. Knees come up. Brace your core. And twist that back. The first exercise that you're gonna see is a squat press. I'm gonna be holding 20, you guys. We're gonna drop a little bit. It's not a huge squat, and more effort on the push up. Are you ready? You got something heavy in your hands? I just wanna make sure I have 220. Sometimes I've had like a 15. This is what it looks like. You're gonna drop a little, push into the heels, drive to press the weights all the way up to the sky. A little bend, push. And this is where you want heavy. I'm not gonna talk much because it's heavy. Squat jumps coming up. No weight, you don't have to jump, right? You can do quick squats. Going in three, two, one, jump it up. 
A little push through the heels. You're going to get more from the butt through the heels. Relax. Oh. Woo. Breather. You got a little more time. You're going to hear the buzzer, but you still have a few more seconds. 15 more seconds. You good? Yeah. Right. That's how you should feel. Woo. Grab your weights. Jen's like, how many times? Twice. Here we go. In three, two, one. Drop. Push. Use your breath. Oh. Pushing your heels, not your toes. Nice job. Nice squat jobs, remember. You can go slower. You don't have to jump. Ready. All right. Last time in the squat jumps. Bend the knees. Push in your heels. Come on, one more. Woo. All right. Catch your breath. Do it okay, though? Everybody's good? Woo. Get some water. Bent over row. Burpee with two supers. Woo. For my supers, I'm going to face that way so I don't hit my dumbbells. Moderate to heavy. I'm going to try 20. Are you ready? 15 seconds on the clock. Take a deep breath. Brace your core. Hinging forward. Ooh, look good. So we can see Jen. She got the bright color today. Pull it back. Love it though. In a bent over row. Pulling the weight between the hips and the belly. Pinch between the shoulder blades. And again, when we're heavy, holy cows, it feels like cardio workout here, right? We're doing that burpee with a super. We come down, we lift up twice. Here we go. Belly, lift, down, lift, come up. You can jump or not. You can step forward, come up. You can even stay on the ground and do alternating arm and legs. If you want to. Sit in child for a moment. Take any options, right? If you're dealing with an injury, you still have more time. You could even stay on all four if you need to. So take those options. Get ready. Band five. Bend over row. Hinge it. Ooh, pull it up. Knuckles down, wrist is straight. Yeah, abs in. Catherine's like, pull those abs in, guys. Woo! Just checking the our form here. Come on, up and pinch. Here we go, burpee. With the super, take your options. Keep your core tight. It's gonna help you move. 
drop. So good for your backside. Nice job. Moving. See, they go fast, don't they? Oh, I need a quick sip of water. Sumo squat. Whew. Heavy weight. I'm gonna use both of my 20s. That's gonna give me 40 pounds. So today, my lightest weight today is 12. My heaviest is a 25. Okay, sumo. You have that turnout position. As long as you're going heavy for you. It's not about going heavy for Michelle. All right, top load. Keeps the chest up. This is what your sumo squat looks like. You stay lower, which is harder. Ready, drop it. Do pulses. Oh yeah. So my dumbbells are a little bit on my shoulders my tailbone straight down. Remember, we want heavy. The next move, we're gonna leap forward or you just do monster walking. All right, when you leap, you guys, you need to be into the heels. We leap forward, walk it back. Leap, walk back. If you need to, you walk forward and you walk back. Try to drop into your heels first, into your butt, then think about your butt activating to help push you forward, not your arms, right? Use your glutes, glutes and your core. When you land, your butt goes down. Oh, my legs. Oh. Whew. Great job. How'd that feel for you guys? Your knees okay? Yes. Get ready. We still have a few more seconds. I was ready to go. I started getting a little nervous, didn't you? Sumo squat. I know. Long breaks though. Recover, deep breath, get in position. Oh yeah. Let's go. One more challenge. Stay low. Rest your heels, right? Think about your butt. You gotta turn it on, because sometimes the quads get too strong and they dominate. That's why I tell you, especially in that leap forward, you gotta think about the butt firing. So fire from the butt, not the toes, not your quads. We're leaping, sit back, walk back. Stay low when you walk back, please. Stay low. There we go. Looking great. Okay, pull your belly up and in. Nice job. Woo. Okay, get yourself some water. Nice work. Woo. So I was shoveling mulch. My legs are feeling it already. You had a pile of mulch over there. Woo. Burpee press. Woo -hoo. <sighs> yeah, that's another workout right there. Burpee press. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna stay heavy, I'm gonna go 20s. So in that burpee, we're coming all the way down, you guys. Push, almost like a swing. If you have lighter, you're not gonna swing like me, okay? Are you ready? And then guess what? Just burpees. Yeah, it's gonna be a fun combination. Are you ready for it though? Ready for fun? 15 seconds. Whew, you gotta make it a little fun, right? Be 
can always step back and then come in and then do a press with lighter weights. Set, all the way down, press. In that press, it feels like a suitcase swing, right? This is where you have to be cautious for your low back. So if you have tendency to get bulging disc, don't use weight. Maybe you just do curl press. Okay, just burpees. I'm gonna put my weights to the back of my mat or to the side of it. Just burpees, but bring it all the way down, you guys. Ready, all the way down. Can you touch your belly to the ground? You get more core. Woo! Nice job. Okay, this is a tough one. It's good for you. I know you don't like it. Breathe. 15 seconds. If we tell ourselves we don't like it, just say, you know, this is gonna make me stronger in a different way. Get ready. Burpee. Put that press up. All the way down. Brace the core. Push it. Ooh. That swing is tough. Come on. You can do it. Oh. Oh. Nice job. Great job, Jen. You're going to power through. Great job, you burpees. Ready. Just keep going. It's easier on your back. You need to bring your stomach all the way down. More back, and we stop in that plank. Just a little bit of FYI, right? Break. Woo. Get some water after that one. You did awesome. Woo. We have an ISO lunge. I'm gonna keep, keep my 20, so I'm keeping them pretty much the whole workout. Whew. And then a lunge jump. Listen to your body. You don't have to lunge jump. You can just lunge pulse. We'll work the right leg first. I'm gonna give you 15 seconds. Keep that heart rate elevated. Yeah, we need a couple of tissues, ready? 10 seconds, we're gonna have right leg forward, left leg back, lunge and push. Now, there's some options with where you want the weight. I actually like the weight up here, I press through the heel, feet separated, so let's back chest up, there we go. You can go slow, you can go fast, your choice. We got those jumps coming on this leg. Oh, because it's gonna be tough. I like tough, don't you? Break. Because when we do that high intensity, we don't have to do big, long, long, huge workouts, right? Here we go. Let's jump, push off. Push off that front foot. Remember, the pulse. Just as effective. That little bit of power fires up type two muscles. Those power muscles. Come on, pull up and in. The other leg is gonna be the hard leg. I'm telling you, three, two, one. Shake it out, walk it around. 
still more time. That in between. Yeah, well this is when you do need the long break, when you're working at that high intense. Whew. So grab your weight, five seconds, four, three, two, and drop. I was like, what is that horrible noise? That was Jen's phone. I was like, the money. Show me the money. Woo. Come on, push. I'm letting my knee touch the floor just gracefully. I'm pushing away. Oh, come on, turn it up. You only have to do each like once. Sometimes I won't be able to talk. I'm working hard, I hope you are too. Get ready for that jump or no jump. Push. Face yourself. Unless you are, unless you got the crazy in you that you need to get out. It's like the mom with the three young kids at home. You got the crazy, right? All of our kids are here are a little older. Come on. Woo! Wait, Carol still's got the crazy. Keep going. You still have the crazy? Yeah, okay, relax. Woo! That block is over. Nice job. Yay, alternating snatch. I got a 20s if anybody wants them. I'm gonna do a 25. Yeah. Snatch, we're gonna alternate. I'm doing 25. I do one arm. Use the legs, bring it down. Quickly do the other side. We are halfway through this workout on the strength section here. Okay, come on down, other arms out. Snatch up and release. This should be moderate to super heavy. I probably could do 30, but I'm just gonna be safe. If you are being safe too. This is a big power movement. You don't wanna hinge forward and round your back. If you have light weights only, you could do both at the same time. All right, we're gonna come on down. You can do mountain climbers or you keep the hips down and you do a climber. Here we go. One foot forward, then switch. Or go into mountain climbers. This is definitely gonna be harder on the upper body. Could be upright doing high knees. Oh my god. Woo! Oh, much harder. But do the level you need. And then when you come back, I right, try to level up. We got a lot of sucking wind today. Here we go, 10 seconds. I'm gonna start with my other arm. Roll it back. Keep the core braced. Fix anything. Snatch. We thrust the hips forward. Waist stays close to the body. There's a move in this X in this workout you don't like. Hey, do something you do enjoy. But we want to get a little uncomfortable because that's when the magic happens. Oh, Whew. climbers. Yeah, Carol, way to push it. Here we go. Climb it. Do a hand release as you climb. For it here, come on. Be a beast, come on, you got this. Oh. Oh. Nice job. Ooh. Catch that breath. Ooh. Hammer curls means thumb up. Heavy. All right, I'm gonna go 20. 
you guys okay back here? All right, so far. At home, you guys okay? All right, hammer time. Too bad I can't throw in some hammer. MC Hammer, I'll get copyrighted. Whoop. Okay, 15 seconds before we hammer curl. Oh. We're tight. Knee soft, this is what a hammer curl looks like. It's really heavy, alternate. If not, you're gonna double hammer. You bring it up, you bring it down. And then we're gonna go into the side forearm plank where we alternate a leg lift. So facing you, and then we're gonna turn and face the back. My hands are feeling the, the shoveling I did up on the mulch. All right, we're gonna face you. Knee or stack. We lift and then rotate to the back. Lift, rotate back. Go guys. <laughs> so you have the option of dropping the knee if you need to. Shoulder core. Yeah, that was kind of a little easier, right? All right, drive away though. Make sure you don't have any rocks on your mat. Here we go. In 10 seconds, sometimes we hit the little rocks underneath the mat. Okay, hammer curls. Shoulders back, chest up. Fist to shoulder. And we got Liza back. She's been gone for a few of these workouts. She's honoring her body. Yes, I know you're gonna be like, so what, what happened to Liza? Her body wasn't honoring her. She had some knee issues. She had a knee, right? One knee, left knee issue here. So you'll see her modify some of the moves, right? Oh, I'm pushing, how about you? All right, let's start on this side. Hips up, kick. Knees back. Get that core braced. This kind of builds on the workout from last week where Catherine and I were doing that side leg lift. Remember that, Catherine? Catherine said she was super sore. I was sore. I'll link that workout. You didn't get a chance to do it. Whew. Catherine just said, it, well, it's definitely shorter than this one. Okay, relax. Nice job. Okay, from that bicep, we're gonna go to the tricep. We're doing skull crushers. I'm gonna do 12. So pick your weight, you're gonna be looking at the sky. If you wanna add leg movement, I'll leave it up to you. And then we flip it for dolphin. Whew. Or push-ups. Guys ready? Get ready, come on your back. Going in 15 seconds. Again, I got 12. Lead us up. Ankle it back a little bit here. Brace the core if you want feet up. I'm gonna have my feet up. Remember, bend the elbows. Press all the way up. Again, moderate, but heavy. Close your eyes. Great opportunity to opportunity to envision you in the future, right? What do you look like? What do you do? What are you having to do to get there? For so long, I've been thinking and we are flipping it. Hey, here's a dolphin. You know, I know everybody knows what a push-up is, but here's dolphin. It's a down dog. Hands inside. We drop the elbows and press. Elbows touch. And press through the heels of the hands. You can do push-ups, Catherine. 
if your technique sucks, you're gonna, you're gonna hurt yourself. Another option, right? I come to my knees, but my hips stay up, and I force the movement coming through the heels of my hands. Pull your belly in. Relax. Okay, second set. Shake it out. You still got 15 seconds. Here's what you can do if you're ready. Have the arms down. It's like an isometric hold here. Oh yeah. <laughs> right? <laughs> you ready? Go. Did you feel that? Oh yeah. Sounds like, oh my god, there's a fire. I think that oh, we need a embrace the challenge, right? Right now we're running around a circle, start to shake or real uncomfortable. That's a good thing. That tells you you're making change. You don't ever feel uncomfortable, or if you don't ever feel like you have a setback, and you're not moving forward. That was tough. <laughs> you're like, thank God they said that. Here we go, dolphin or push-ups. Yes, I can. Even if I do fewer, I'm doing what I can. hands out too wide, right? We want to keep those, when we think of triceps, those movements are always at least shoulder width or inside the frame of the body. Oh, nice job. Are you shaking? Woo. Woo. All right, you guys, we got, we're coming in. We have a back lunge, just two more blocks. Whew, each block is around three minutes and 30 seconds, just so you know that, right? I'm gonna do my 20s. I'm gonna hold on to my 20s, get some back lunge. You're gonna go back and then tap forward. You can do a knee up, whatever feels good to you. And you know what's nice? I can really hear them today because sometimes we play music. Today is no music. I can hear them breathing heavy. I think I can hear you at home. Okay, right leg will stay. Left leg is gonna lunge back. So back lunge. I'm gonna load at the top. Where are you loading? Bottom. Lunge, tap. A moving lunge now versus ISO. Press through the heel. When you come forward, think of your butt pushing you forward. Driving the heel. Each leg is just once. Do all you can. Weight down. That leg. Lateral lunge. You can rotate to the knee. Good. Rotate. If your foot kind of goes back behind a standing leg. You push in your heel. Right. Don't rush this. Come down, then push. So you kind of release from that leg. One more. I just gotta check, the wind blew really hard. We're good, we're still good. All right, I can still see you. Whew. Lunging, other leg. Core tight. Let me start with my foot up here. Nice and tall. Fire from the butt. Go 
Going over to that side. Lunge, power off. Use your legs, not your low back to get down. Maybe further. Oh yeah. I went further and I thought I wasn't gonna come back. Woo. Nice job. One more move. Don't clap yet. Who's clapping? All right. She's just excited. She's just excited. Hey, okay. dumbbell sit up. I'm gonna do my 12s so that we can focus a little chest, a little core. Right. Both arms press as I kick the leg up. Come up as high as you feel that you can. Yeah, this feels good, right? Yep. We're coming to it though. We gotta work a little bit more. Ready? Go. Punch up. Smooth like peanut butter. You got a little crunchy going on. That's all right. Crunchy could be okay. You can always have bent knees. You wanna go all the way up. That kick just gives more, a little quad goes deeper in the core, all right, forearm plank, hip drops, I'm just going to flip, making some rainbows, all right, on your elbows, hip to the front, to the back, go up, then over, Use it. exhale, don't rush this. Relax. Back into that press. Try different things that work for you. So if you don't like the kick, you can go. You can go straight leg. All right, here we go. Are you mentally ready? Oh yeah, we're mentally ready. Okay. In three. Ladies are working it today. I know you at home, you are busting this workout. You can share a selfie. I love to share them on my Instagram, so send me a message. Oh my gosh, come on. Oh, nice way, way to push it. Love it. Here we go, forearms. We are there. Make some rainbows. Pulling up and in. A lot of shoulders in this workout. They're your stabilizers. Okay, this is where we just do a little small intermission here, okay? Whew. Shake it out. If you need to clear any space, you're gonna do so right now, but we got a four minute finisher, which is a Tabata. Eight moves, one time each, 20 seconds of full out effort. If this is not for you, for the high impact, hey, you are done and we'll see you at the next workout, okay? So are you ready at home? Yes, you are. Ladies behind me, driveway crew. Woo. We got a drop squat down, up. Lies are gonna modify. Drop, zip. If you want to, twist. Got a twist, right? You can step it out, step it in. It can be smaller. I like the twist. Jack, 
cloths in front. We can also go right here. But that open close makes it a little bit more on the core. Cross. Drop, then come in. Don't rush it. More burpees. Add a jump if you want to touch down, you can. I'm going to face this way because of my equipment. To a sit up, so flip it all the way up, all the way down. So we're just doing a full range sit up here. Go. Ken's got a great option. This crunch. Shoot the feet back, flip it for mountain climbers. Whew. And give me some speed on the climbers. Ready. Shoot the heels of the hands. Drop the hips. Chin up. Come on, 10 seconds. Bicycle, flip it. Same kind of pattern. Lift the head and shoulders up. If you want, you can be on your elbows. I'm gonna be down on my back. Step back. Keep your legs low and don't bring them too much into the chest. That'll make it harder. You're up. Skaters. Ooh. We'll jump over to the right side first. Come to that left side of your mat. You can step or jump. Push off. Stay low. Use the outside of your hip. So you have to use your arms a lot. That's a sign your glutes are weak. More leg. Balance. move. It's a high knee run. Woo, that's it. You can twist to the knee. Keep the length. Go. You can move it. Come on, chest up. Use your arms. Done. Woo. Nice job. Give somebody high tens. You need tens today because that was a long workout. You guys. Woo. All right. Let's just stretch it out. Nice work today. Oh, I'm still catching my breath. How about you? That wasn't so bad. That was a nice little steady state. So open the legs out, interlock behind, open the chest. Yeah, we did a lot of burpees. Burpee variations, good for your core. Hinge it. And then relax the hands down. Give me a lateral lunge. You're gonna be bending that right knee. You can move on that left foot. Depends on your knee. Or you can be more upright if you need to be. Or you can drop, drop down. This is a good one for mobility in your ankle. Other side. So turn your foot out. Straddle. We're gonna turn to the garage, drop that knee and then reach up and lunge. 
push the hips forward, lengthen up, reach to the back, so side stretch, pull the toes up in the front leg, so let's do toes up, straddle, other side, lunge, knee, reach it up, and then if you want to do side, that feels really good. And then pull the toes up, hamstring. Back to straddle. Bend the knees, walk in with the feet, roll yourself up. Give yourself a big inhale, reach it up. Pull it into your heart. Behind the head, open the chest. Reach out in T, thumbs go down. Go back, now thumbs go up, look up. Relax, roll the shoulders. Last big inhale. Gratitude is the attitude here. Pull it into your heart and you touch that skin. You guys, you have an awesome day. Thank you for hitting play and staying till the end. Yay for you. Yay to these guys, they did awesome. Make sure you do thumb it up if you enjoyed the workout. Comment below, share this with a friend. Hey, give me a selfie. I'd love to see you guys. And we will see you back on this mat. Take care, guys. Woo!